I have a story I'd like to tell. It happened a long time ago. And my memory is just as vivid now as it was then. I don't know who cares to listen, but those who do and relate will understand the significance of that which plagues an old man. It is about Annabelle Lee. You see, it was many and many a year ago in a kingdom by the sea that a maiden there lived and you may know by the name of Annabel Lee and this maiden well she lived with no other thought than to love and be loved by me I was a child and she was a child in this kingdom by the sea. But we loved with a love that was more than love. I and my Annabelle Lee. With a love that the winged seraphs of heaven coveted her and me. And this was the reason that Long ago, in this kingdom by the sea, a wind blew out of a cloud, chilling my beautiful Annabelle Lee. So their high-born kinsmen came and bore her away from me to shut her up in a sepulcher in this kingdom by the sea. And the angels, well, not half so happy in heaven, went envying her and me. Yes, that was the reason, as all men know, in this kingdom by the sea, that the wind came out of the cloud by night, chilling and killing my Annabelle Lee. But our love was stronger by far than the love of those who were older than we, of many far wiser than we. And neither the angels in heaven above nor the demons down under the sea can ever dissever my soul from the soul of the beautiful belly for the moon never beams without bringing me dreams of the beautiful Annabelle Lee and the stars never rise but I feel the bright eyes of the beautiful Annabelle Lee and so yes it is true and so all the night tide I lie down by the side of my darling, my darling, my life, my bride. In the sepulcher there by the sea, in her tomb by the sounding sea,